Hey, this is Yuri and welcome to Wall Parts. Today we're going to be demonstrating how you can change the transfer case fluid on a 2019 Ram 1500. This is also going to apply to all 2011 to 2022 Ram 1500 models with the Bogwarner 44 or 48 type transfer cases. There are some slight visual differences between the two transfer cases, but the general steps and procedures are still going to be the same. For this demonstration, we're going to be using the Revenol BW44 transfer case fluid, which offers several performance benefits over other transfer case fluids on the market. To learn more about the proper RAM 1500 transfer case fluid specifications, fill capacities, change intervals, and our convenient transfer case and differential fluid change kits, check out the link in the description below. So let's get started. Begin by confirming that the transfer case is warm. This allows the fluid to drain more thoroughly while it's being drained. During the fluid change, the vehicle will need to be in a level position. Most Ram 1500 transfer case fluid changes can be done on a flat, level surface without lifting the vehicle. In our case, we're going to be gaining access to the bottom side of the vehicle by using an automotive lift. To confirm you are lifting the vehicle correctly, you can reference your factory owner's manual for the proper vehicle lift point locations and safety procedures. Next, locate the transfer case fluid fill plug. This is located on the rear side of the transfer case closest to the drive shaft. Loosen and remove the fill plug in a counterclockwise direction using a 3 a square bit or ratchet. Removing the fill plug before the drain plug confirms you have a way to refill the transfer case with fluid in case the fill plug is seized or cannot be removed. Next, locate the transfer case fluid drain plug. This is located on the lower left section of the transfer case. Loosen and remove the drain plug in a counterclockwise direction using a 3 a square bit or ratchet. Allow the old transfer case fluid to thoroughly drain into a suitable waste oil drain pan. Using a clean rag and wire brush, clean the drain and fill plugs from excess corrosion, contaminants, and debris. Next, apply a small amount of automotive grade thread sealant or high temperature RTV on the drain and fill plug threads to ensure a quality seal with no leaks. Reinstall the drain plug, threading it in a clockwise direction. Using a 3 a square bit and torque wrench, tighten the drain plug to the recommended 15 foot-pound torque specification. Next, begin filling the transfer case with fluid that meets or exceeds the recommended Bogwarner 44 and 48 transfer case fluid specification. The correct transfer case fluid level has been achieved when a stream of fluid begins overflowing from the transfer case fluid fill port. This is between 1.4 and 1.8 liters depending on the exact year of your Ram 1500. With the transfer case fluid level confirmed, you can begin installing the fill plug by threading it in a clockwise direction. Using a 3 a square bit and torque wrench, tighten the fill plug to the recommended 15 foot-pound torque specification. Using a rag, Clean and remove all excess fluid from the transfer case fluid drain and fill plug locations. The transfer case should be completely cleaned from any fluid residue. This will help when inspecting and confirming that the transfer case does not have any leaks after performing your fluid change. So that is a quick overview on how to change the transfer case fluid on a 2011 to 2022 Ram 1500 model with either the Bogwarner 44 or 48 type transfer case. If you have any other questions or for more information on the transfer case fluids that we do offer, feel free to visit our website at blowparts.com. If you found this video helpful, be sure to give it a thumbs up and feel free to subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching.